You know we're down to try anything on this show. On the agenda today, learn how to play bocce ball. Yes. Okay, so it turns out this might have been the sport we were destined for all along. Yeah. Turns out you can drink. Check. Trash talk. Check. And make off-color jokes about the other team's bocce balls. Check. But thanks to our friends from the Lexington Bocce Association for teaching us how to play. We had a great day. Check it out. One of the great things about bocce balls, we can see, you can do several things while you're playing bocce ball. Bocce is a sport that you can play with one hand, so as long as you got one hand free, you're good to go. The Lexington Bocce Association is less than four months old, technically, um, but we have been organizing uh, bocce leagues around Lexington. The object of the game is to take your larger colored ball and get it as close to the target ball, called the Polino, as possible. Eric is doing a bang-up job, by the way, and he's doing it through unbelievable duress because he's got these people over here, I want you to look over, that are judging him and mocking every move he makes over there. Are these your teammates or your enemies? Uh, well, we're on the same team in that we are all part of the Lexington Bocce Association. They are all co-founders, uh, but none of them are actually my Bocce partner. Okay. So. How much trash talking is there in Bocce Ball? You have no idea. You have no idea. You have tiny hands. You're going to be horrible. Mm. Here we go. Trash talk again. You're horrible. You're so bad at this. Oh, Lord. So it becomes part of the contest itself. Uh, it, it incorporates itself. I mean, who, if you can get inside a guy's head. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, and all of us have utilized some sort of that strategy at one time or another. Well, if you're friends, you know his weaknesses, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And we will, uh, when you have a couple that's playing that's married, oh. if you can get the spouse mad at the other one, you got it. Oh, you're, you're done. Oh, yeah, you're done. Oh. Right. things with, this is why she left you. you know, <laughs> that kind of thing. Because you're a loser. What a story. Came from a trailer park. Tennessee. It's now here Homecoming I am. queen of her junior high. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's when she dropped out. Mm -hmm. Now okay. about to become a bocce ball champion. I'm going to slay you. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, right yeah. 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 Did you look at that? They're touching. They're touching. So Haley and I could be a bocce ball team. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, okay. We got to get uniforms, right? Uh, special shirts would be good. Yeah. What about unitards? I'm game. That's what you we're are? comfortable yeah. in. That's what we together yeah. are most comfortable in. Unitards? Lee especially. Okay. It took me a while to get on board, but I'm there now. Right. I'm so, there. I mean, because uh, I like to wrestle. <laughs> Well, this is not typically a contact sport, but, you know, there's a first time for everything. I never be. believed in just natural talent until today. And then here we are. And I'm winning. Got it. Got oh. it. No! And so red has the point. One yes. Rockhouse Brewing is Rock where Brewing. they've got this little arena for bocce ball. Yeah, it's really, really cool. neat. That's their indoor court. And, yeah, so they've paired up. You can, you know, get a craft beer while you're there playing. And, yeah, one of the big things they told us was all the teams in their, uh, in the Lexington Bocce Association, they have competitions to see who can come up with the most creative names. Yeah. Some of the ones they had, Chubachi and Notorious Bocce. Ours, Resting Bocce Face and Botulism. <laughs> okay. For more information about creating a team or joining the league, visit the Lexington Bocce Association on Facebook. All right. Pet of the Day coming up next.